Okay, so we are headed out. We're literally going for 24 hours, but you know what? The mountains are calling and I must go. It's not deep into the mountains. It's only about 9,300 feet more. So it's about 3,000 feet more than where we're at now. It's about an hour and a half to two hours, depending on traffic. And it can get there an hour and a half if we don't have any, you know, setbacks. So not too, too far in, just a little taste. We just stopped it. We just stopped off of our exit, off the highway, and it's um, this is Silverthorn, and we stopped at McDonald's to go pee, and we're about, I think, six miles, something like that, to the town of Dillon, um, off this exit. But even going to McDonald's to go pee, do you see the <laughs> mountains behind us? And there's some snow on that one. I don't know if you can see it. It feels great out here. Um, I don't know what the temperature is, but it feels really nice. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, it's definitely cooler. It's supposed to be 90 in the city today, and it's it did say 66, but the car's been sitting, so it's a little bit up now. It's probably 70. So, little man has been amazing. He's been talking, and he's been doing this lately, where he gets his arms out of the uh, straps he's still strapped in the bottom but he keeps getting his arms out of the top i'm gonna have to tighten it up anyway just thought i'd show you my view from mcdonald's and it's only going to get better from this it's been a beautiful drive though it's only like 60 miles from the city but it's been beautiful <laughs> we went and reserved our campsite and i will do a tour of that when we get back and we just stopped at this little park that I saw another vlogger talk about in the city of Frisco. And it's like open space. There's a, a creek right here that you can hear. And then um, it's right by the parking. And then there's a little playground. So Harrison just went and played. So um, bathrooms, everything. So we're going to make us a sandwich here and just relax. And then we're going to walk down the streets of Frisco. It's such a cute little mountain town. So, and then we'll go back up probably about four or five. We'll go back up to the campsite and uh, it's beautiful. It's overcast right now and it's in the seventies. So it just feels great. And of course it's dry, not humid. So anyway, yep. It's really, a really cool area.
to train. Choo -choo. He's like, I want to touch it. Now it's coming over here. You see it? Oh my goodness. Look at the choo choo. Oh, daddy. Oh, there it is. Here it comes. Oh my, is he smiling? He's just looking. Oh my goodness. Miss Passy because he was starting to fuss. It's in the afternoon, nap time, so he threw a little fit in the middle of the crosswalk. <laughs> so give Miss Passy. But it's so pretty. The, the breeze is so nice and the views are nice and he wanted to swing. Sean's head was really hurting from the altitude, so he's laying down. I've been kind of just setting stuff up. Um, this is kind of our setup. This is Harrison's bed. Um, our electric will go out there and the window will go up. Maybe. Um, we got stuff piled in the front, like um, his chair, his car seat, our clothes bags, food, stuff, that, stuff like that. And then this is our bed. Um, I thought we were sleeping with our head at that end. But I guess we're not. I guess we're gonna try sleeping with our heads at this end. Because I hear us. But um, yeah, that's pretty much what we're doing. Um, I'll try to show you our campsite. This is letters that I brought for him to play with, and he has them everywhere out here. I've got stuff over here in this chair because Sean's gonna grill a steak for us. Can you see those mountains in the background? <laughs> um, and then uh, we're right up next to a hill. Um, I'll show you when I get out, and then like the. The grill, the firing, all that stuff is up there. So, anyway, this is kind of our setup. The breeze has been amazing. We are loving sitting here. Amazing. What do you think? It's probably about 70, 72, maybe? Uh, maybe. Um, but the breeze is cloudy and overcast, and the hey, breeze so what is, the is so where I'm nice. At right now? So, he's Harrison's having a time. He is 71. 71. Um, Harrison is loving, loving the outdoors right now. He's playing. Playing out there, forty nine fifty. I've I've seen both. Um, that's why I said it's not going to be too too bad. And then we're just just relaxing until we go cook. He is loving playing in and out of the car and with all of this stuff. He's had a lot of fun today, hasn't he? Oh, he's had a blast. So anyway, that's what we're doing. Did you show him a stick? No. Where is your stick? I didn't see it. It's here. Can you show everybody your bed? Where's your bed? Bed. Yeah. Is that your bed? Oh, good job. Good job. I think we're going to be comfortable tonight. The bed's going to help. <laughs> it's going to be help having a real mattress in here. So um, we're kind of glamping. But we have determined that we're going to maybe dry camp next time. Oh, I think we just saw the Grand Canyon. Yeah, we're going to dry camp because I want to So be... we're going to go like in the forest, like uh, BLM land, which is Bureau of Land Management. They And also the forest, they have free campsites. And so um, we're just going to try to boom dot next time, I think. I didn't want to, I wanted to play it a little safe our first time into the mountains, but it's been, it's been good. All right, so we are literally on like the side of a cliff. Um, that is the mountain range around us. Of course, video looks so much worse than real life. This is our picnic table. 
firing. Over there is the grill. And then if you look down here, I don't know if you can see it or not, our van is down there. So we had to kind of walk up this path to get to our little picnic area. So that's what we're doing. We're gonna grill a steak. And I got a couple little potatoes. We're gonna put in some, I forgot my onions, in a packet and uh, grill. I forgot the butter. Probably if I had one, this has been a pretty good place to camp so far, but if I had one gripe, it would be all of this dirt. Like it just flies everywhere. Harrison's feet and socks are filthy. <laughs> uh, this is our, our, our backyard right now, is this like rocky ledge. <laughs> so... Kind of keeping an eye out for any farmers. I've been seeing a couple chipmunks, and one of them came up while ago, and I didn't get my camera out quick enough. Harrison is having a blast. He has played so much since we got here. And uh, just sitting here, my hoodie foot finishes up dinner, enjoying these mountain ranges. There's still snow on the top of these over here. A little bit of snow. So, yeah, pretty good campground. his little bed. Sean's up here and uh, we still have the back open with our mosquito netting. It's kind of loose now but it's getting cooler for sure. Um, let me lighten this up. I can lighten up a little bit. Our power cord comes in through the window. Mm, this window and to a power strip over here and then Sean has his um, his breathing machine, I have my power cord for my phone and the little LED lamp. Um, Which we didn't need. Oh, that's better. It's pixelated, but you can kind of see out there. That light is the bathroom light that's next to us. But that's the little road. But um, it cleared up and the stars are like really everywhere. Like it's really clear outside. So anyway, um, that's all for tonight probably. Harrison's all settled in and he had a little bit of trouble going to sleep but then once he was still and went to sleep he was good so anyway we'll see how cold it gets it's chilly like it feels good though like it's a good chilly with the door open when we close it's the door great. when we go to sleep we'll close the back hatch so you know we'll see how cold it gets in here tonight but I didn't expect it to get real real cold so Anyway. I look pretty rough. <laughs> okay, I look pretty rough. Um, but I haven't combed my hair or anything. I just went to the restroom and then this is our van. That blue thing is the netting. I just took it out when I opened the van up. But what I really wanted to show you was the sun hitting those mountains. I don't see no new snow up there. And then uh, these mountains over here, they all look pretty. Anyway. We're just getting awake. It's like 645. It's 46 degrees. Um, it got pretty cool in the van, but as long as you're under a blanket, you're okay, I think. And little man had a bunch of blankets on him. And so this is our setup. I just took this stroller out to get to my bag, but um, the electric is just run through the window, pretty airtight, so that we have electric inside. And uh, that's our setup. But it's a beautiful crisp morning at 46 degrees. I'm going to make coffee in a little bit. <laughs>
say hi. Hi. Say hi. <laughs> hi. We're all up now. <laughs> he slept so good. Whoosh. Waiting to see if there's it's starting to warm up yeah yeah um sean just went in this little visitor center we just stopped at a little mountain town about 45 minutes from home to see if we could find like a little breakfast place she said you look like you can eat oh she was nice heel daddies go go that way it's between uh, starbucks and carl's junior mcdonald's she said they make the best breakfast Headed into the city, but everybody else is headed out of the city for Labor Day weekend. Um, everybody is headed to the mountains for the weekend. I mean, the traffic is yucky over there. Just got in the door. I brought in a few things from the car, not everything. I have plenty of time to unpack the car, so I brought like few of the things that I knew we needed and he's already in his corner playing and um, yeah just gonna sit here and relax for a little bit and um, I hope you enjoyed this vlog I hope you enjoyed our little 24 hour turnaround mountain camping adventure it was our first time in the mountains and overall I really enjoyed it and we've decided that we're gonna make more little short trips like this so anyway make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber so that you can follow along on our adventures and leave a comment down below if you like to camp or you've ever camped in the mountains, what your favorite thing is about camping. And, um, yeah, we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. Harrison, say bye-bye.